It's Valentine's Day. This is romantic-ish. In the sweet stench of after sex and sweat, you start asking me silly questions like, how do you feel right now? I want to say beautiful. I want to say wonderful, splendid, and or fantastic, but I've been having this real Pinocchio complex lately, and despite my recent Twitter twits and updates, I want to be a real boy someday, so instead, I say... Like, a, like you tilt your head like a dog hearing metal scrape. So I feel like I have the need to elaborate and I'm all like, yeah, babe, I'm feeling a little bit uncomfortable here. Like a mallard bastard whose father fled a flight patterns backwards, now they know they'll never get home again. Like hickeys or flesh wounds underneath grandmother's eyes on Thanksgiving. Like itching or bleeding, you really don't want to have to explain to a doctor. Stay with me, I know it's Monday and snake, but it's kind of like anal sex for the first time. And it feels fine. No, it feels better. Feels like sunshine, hand grenades, splendor, thunder, and you're not even worried. Well, how are you gonna explain this shit to your girlfriend when she finds out later? It was just some guy. We were both drunk and a little bit high. There might have been some cocaine involved. They said they were a poet. Awkward. <laughs> Like bow ties and G-strings, like G-strings and fat men, like underage Robin chilling with cave-dwelling Batman, like that one time I drank the vodka through the beer funnel, like artists partying with frat boys, like I discuss poetry as if it were sexual secrets, like I can't believe I'll ever let my real boys hear this shit. Uh like I got sunbeams beneath my flesh, and I'm just trying to fuck an albino. Want nothing more than a poor, out of a forest to kill. I'm just trying to conquer awkward. Like I can't believe this is my ugly fucking vocabulary. Like self-examination, and I got lumps on my heartbeat. Like I got stains engraved into my DNA that makes it really hard for me to have to stay. Yeah, babe, I'm feeling a little bit uncomfortable here, a little bit out of my element, a little bit. Right then, at that moment, that perfect fucking moment, your face, your fucking perfect face becomes a snowman's made in May, and it just melts the fuck away, and the room becomes a not so fun house full of mirrors contorting you closer and further and further and further, and I wasn't expecting you to be as brave as you are beautiful. As you see, with an aid of no canoe, we make it up the rapids I created and say, well, yeah, babe. Me too. Yo, welcome to the Dirty Jared Poetry Fucking Show! It's the second half of the night. It's a little bit later. If we can do our jobs, you'll feel a little bit looser. <laughs> 